Welcome back guys to Factorio Invasion of Planet Earth. We are in our next episode. I'm thinking it's number 55 or so. Somewhere around there. But uh, anyways, we are here in South America where we uh, actually spent a little time in between episodes uh, just doing a few little... Um, uh, a few little improvements and things, uh, and research mostly. I think I improved on the research so that we could have the atomic bomb available, and that way we can, uh, when we next visit the biters, we can make some more progress. I also did some improvements to the productions of the various rocket parts and I think if I'm not mistaken, oh you know what I did forget to do was to put uh, extra chests over here on and I don't even have any chests on me and um, yeah what I was gonna do here was this and this, so that this would be like this. Yeah, that way we have <clears throat> everything that we need to launch our first rocket stored up in chests. So that when we decide to launch the rocket, which, yeah, we can do any time now. We are... We are ready. Let's see. Did I put the... Yes, I did. Okay. Yes. Okay. So we're ready to launch our first rocket at any time. Uh, I did some work on uh, the shipping industry. Um, I, I edited the um, schedule for the, the, the ships on this side. Um, so that that would be better. And also... Wait a minute. Where am I going here? I want to go back over to where the, uh, the, um, uh, uranium is to grab some uranium so that we can build a few atomic bombs. And yeah, here we are. So Covrex processing is spinning away and it is... Why is that one not running? Oh, it's because it's out of... Yeah, okay, so if I... Let's go ahead and finish setting this up here. I like to do this kind of Covrex processing, actually. Where it's kind of each... It's, it's much easier to manage. Uh, so anyway, let me grab... Uh, I'll grab as much as I can hold. And we'll just put... Uh, let's see, we'll put some in this chest. And we'll put half of it in this chest. And the rest of it in this chest there. Okay, and that will get all of the Covrex uh, machines working. And, well, actually, if I take these out of here and put them in there... Take those out of there and put them in here. There we go. That. And turn that one the right way. There we go. Okay, now all of them are working. Alright, and then... What that does is it allows... Uh, each... Each... Uh, uh, centrifuge... To manage its own Covrex processing. And then they will share also. So that, that should keep them running. Anyway, I did it for reasons um, <clears throat> that uh, it's just easier to manage, basically. And I thought that I had. A supply of 235 available. Here they are. They all ended up in this one machine. Let's see. That one's running and there's 39 in there. Yeah, so I think 
If I look at the atomic bomb recipe, oh, it does call for 30 U-235. Okay, so I can put nine of these back. Nine, and that gives me 30 of those. And let's see, then I need 10 of those and 10 of those. Okay, so we're going to let that stir for a little bit. We'll go ahead and make one nuclear bomb. Uh, we're going to go grab some of the TNT right here, or explosives rather. Grab some of that. And what else did we need? Uh, 10 rocket control units, which we'll get right over here. Uh, let's see, here they are right here. We'll grab 10 of those. And that'll give us one atomic bomb. Okay. So we'll go sh uh, spread the love over there in Africa. We'll grab some more laser turrets. And we'll grab some more those. What else do we need? That should be it. Oh, uh, let's see. It would. Okay, we got plenty of those. All right. So, yeah, that should be all we need. And uh, since we're not doing any research and we have a supply of everything, we'll go ahead and set this up for the rocket. We'll just go ahead and launch the rocket in uh, this episode. At the end of the episode, we'll send the rocket. So we need a hundred of those, a hundred of those, and a hundred of those which we have in stock and that will get the rocket ready all right so we'll go blast uh our nuclear bomb over there in africa uh let's see i do have that on me yes i do <clears throat> so that um that will finally let the biters know that we mean business. And so far, I haven't heard of any survivors in other parts of the world. So we're just going to keep moving through Africa. Um, if, since that's the case, let's go ahead and add some more. Um... more of uh, accumulators over here why do we have no power at all um we, maybe we better see why what's going on here we're completely out of power okay not sure what's happened here but that's something that we probably need to address why are we out of power? What has happened here? I'm not sure. And, yep, I need some kind of fuel. Just kickstart this thing. We have anything in here? Have a little bit of coal. We'll take that. And we have, yeah, we have plenty of uh, that fuel right there, solid fuel. So might have to work on our um, our plans here, whatever. Put this in here and oh yeah of course I have another one of those yes <clears throat> okay that should get everything kick-started again and the only I guess we're just not making enough well we have plenty of petroleum gas I think maybe we're just 
overtaxing our uh, potential power generation is the issue. So let's see, we have four of those, okay. Let's see if we can't make this a little better here. A second to fire up there we go that did it and as long yeah it's probably just a matter of over abusing our uh, lasers. So we'll just add some more production here and that should electric production and that should fix that issue. All right, now let's see here. Let's do that and I don't need this wall here anymore either but that's our okay let's see production wise yeah we're going good we're charging the accumulators that should be all good all right and ah what are we doing with the solid or the okay yeah, we should be... Oh yeah, we're converting everything into... Light oil goes that way. Okay, we might want to add one for light oil or two maybe. Let's see, do I have a couple? Yes. <clears throat> we'll add... Let's see, that's light oil over there. Yeah, we'll do two of them on light oil. I think we can do them right here and there and there and we'll just get some light oil fed over here Like this. That, okay, that should keep everything moving. All right. Okay, so anyway, we have spent our whole episode fiddling with this stuff, and now it's time to send our our nuclear weapon into um, the biters over here in Africa let's see do I have the walls on me no I don't we'll come back to that later let's see where are we going okay yeah so we're gonna take over North Africa, we're going to take this iron mine. And once we get that copper mine, then we'll be in a place where we can actually start to have a base here in Africa. So let's uh, switch to our rocket launcher. And let's find a place where we can... You know what? Uh, let's see. Yeah, we'll do it on foot. We'll be fine. Have to find the best the best place to do it. 
where it will create the most benefit for us, I think. Should be able to do it right about here. Oh no! Yeah, that actually turned out pretty good. There we go. And we'll do a quick run down here with with our um, Thunderbots, which are very effective also at spreading Uh oh, get out of the goo. down here don't want to get too carried away with ourselves what are we after we're after that copper that copper mine down there and this iron mine uh, let's see here we should be able to get up in here a little bit Kind of tricky when there's all these trees around. It's hard to see where we're going. Hard to see the goo. Might let's see. Do we have any grenades? Do I? Yes, I do have grenades. Maybe we'll clear a path. There we go. Clear a little bit of a path here so that we can have access to the interior a little bit oh this is okay i did keeps accidentally switching my buttons there all right now that that was good enough there we go okay we're accumulating and let's see can we do Okay. All right. Now let's just go back. Before we end the episode, we're going to just go back to our foothold here and make sure that we're producing enough fuel to keep our power plant running. And then we'll head back to South America to restock on some essential items. Let's just do a quick run up here. See how we're doing. Yeah, that's much better. We have plenty of plenty of power there. Generation possibility. All right, so <clears throat> that's good enough. All right, so we're gonna end the episode right there, guys. We'll pick it up next time, where we will continue our conquest of Africa. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye bye.